in today's LEGO Star Wars rumor video, we're going to be taking a look at some new leaks delivered to us by 1414 Falcon Fan and Promo Bricks for 2024 LEGO Star Wars releases. I saw these leaks over on Instagram. I'll leave a link to both 1414 Falcon Fan and Promo Bricks Instagram in the description below, as well as my Instagram so you can follow me over there. All right, let's jump right into this. Starting off, we have what I am the most excited about for sure, set number 75372 a clone vs droid battle pack. This set is said to have a total of 215 pieces and is set to release on January 1st of 2024. The price of this set is $30. It is said that this battle pack will come with a total of 10 minifigures. These figures will be a mixture of both clone troopers and battle droids, and we will finally be seeing the return of the super battle droid. This super battle droid information is great because we haven't gotten one in a set in a very long time, and based on recent comments by Lego Star Wars designers, this will probably be a redesigned Super Battle Droid. The included clone troopers have not yet been identified regarding what legion they will belong to. My hope is we will get regular Phase 2 clone troopers here, but only time will tell. Moving on to our next leak, we have set number 75374, Skeleton Crew Ship. This set is set to have a total of 1,325 pieces and is set to release January 1st. The price of this set is also $140. It's great that we're getting another large set at that $140 price point, but this just confirms even more that the 2022 ATTE is on its way out. So if you want to pick up a few more, the time is now to buy the ATTE because it looks like it's going to retire at the end of 2023. Our next two leaks, I'm just going to group together for time's sake. Set number 75375, Millennium Falcon MIDI scale with an undisclosed piece count but with a price of $80. And set number 75376, the Tantive 4 MIDI scale, as well with an undisclosed piece count, but a price point of $80. Both of these MIDI scale sets are set to release on March 1st of 2024. Our next leak is set number 75378, Grogu's Escape from the Mandalorian Season 7. With an undisclosed piece count, but a price point of $30, this set's release date is May 1st of 2024. This set is nice because we finally get another Jedi character, which is always cool to have. Hopefully we get a Shock Trooper or two in this set, so the Shock Trooper isn't locked behind the upcoming Republic gunship, coming out in September of 2023. Our next leak is kind of underwhelming, if I'm being honest. Set number 75379 a buildable R2-D2 with an undisclosed piece count, but a price of $100. This set is set to release on March 1st of 2024. I know he's a fan favorite, but this isn't something I'm particularly excited for, but it'll be a great opportunity for those who missed the previous two to pick one up. Now, moving on to our next leak, I think this is super cool. We have set number 75380, Boon to Eve Pod Race Diorama. Now, there's no piece count, currently, but it is priced at $70 and is set to release May 1st of 2024. We've been saying for a long time now that the prequels deserve some love when it comes to these diorama sets, and I'm glad we're finally getting one. Hopefully this trend continues to the other areas of the prequels. Our next leak is set number 75381, Droidica, for $70 and an unknown piece count with a release date of May 1st, 2024. We're seeing a continuation of buildable characters, which I don't really know what to think about that. I'm not really a huge fan of buildable characters, but I'll be honest, I'm excited to see how LEGO pulls this off as we've seen their attempts at droids in the past. Next up, we have an unknown set, set number 75382, with a price point of $240, with a release date of May 1st. This has to be a Master Builder Series set or small UCS set of some kind. Second to last, we have set number 75384, Young Jedi Adventures Crimson Firehawk. This is set to be a 4 plus set with 136 pieces and a price of $50 with a release date of January 1st, 2024. And lastly, we have yet another diorama set, set number 75387, Tantive 4 Boarding Diorama. This set has an undisclosed piece count, but a price point of $50 and is set to be released on March 1st of 2024. This set will probably include a nice Darth Vader figure that we've been getting for some time now, a Stormtrooper or two, and some new Rebel Troopers, so that's great. 
Well, that's all I have for you today regarding LEGO Star Wars leaks for 2024. 2024 seems like it's going to be a great year for LEGO Star Wars fans. Hopefully all of these leaks are accurate and hold up to be true. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below and let me know what you think some of the unknown aspects of these leaks could be. I know I have my theories, but I'd love to know yours. Also, be sure to check out my other LEGO Star Wars product and set reviews on the end screen now. Thank you.